Howdy, Mark Serbu, gun designer, gun nut. Just got a uh, kind of interesting and quick little video here on a problem I'm having to deal with on the trunnion for the BFG 50A, the semi auto 50 BMG that we make. Uh, anyway, got to tap some really tiny holes, and man, it's, uh, it's a real pain in the butt. And uh, I'm going to show you how I'm doing it here. It's uh, pretty wild. Okay, so here's the trunnion. See, it's the Mark II, yay! Um, and it's got the threaded holes for the spokes. And if you look, they're actually really tiny, uh, you know, they're bicycle spoke threads. Um, for those of you who know this sort of thing, the minor diameter of the thread is 0 .078 inches, and then the major diameter is just around a tenth of an inch, 0.1 inches. Now the crazy thing is, you see how we've got uh, three different rings here. This little tiny tool, this little thread mill has to go in there and make three passes. So it's uh, it's pretty tedious stuff and uh, you know, I'm scared to death the thing's going to break, of course. Uh, and let's see what it looks like to, uh, to simulate this. So I'm just, I'm just clearing this away so we've got, we can see what we're doing here. We're just uh, center drilling. Then we drill the holes, and then we're going to come thread mill. Look at that. Three passes. So each, each depth pass is just a few thousands deeper than the previous one. And man, that's just, uh, that's just crazy stuff, isn't it? It's wild that the simulation shows you exactly how it's going to be. So I'm out there machining this right now. And I was a little scared at first, of course, because man, this this tool is, you know, the, the diameter of the of the tip of this thing is sixty thousandths of an inch. It's just, it just looks like a little nothing. I mean, look at this. What this thing looks like, insanely tiny. But you know, you got to do what you got to do. Sit for the threaded holes. Okay, I've just been through the scariest part, and that's when you come up to the machine, you open the doors, and you see him. Oh, is my tool still alive? And look at that thing. It is just unbelievably tiny. And look at the job it did. And of course, the proof is in the pudding. Well, the spoke thread in, and man, it does. Yay! Crazy. That's great. Uh, unfortunately, it took 27 minutes to, to thread six holes, which is terrible. <laughs> I mean, unless you got like a a whole table full of these things laid out and you, you machine them all night long. Holy crap. Uh, now this is just the initial trial. Just trying trying to get the speeds and feeds right. And you know, you got to be cautious. Those little tools are about 55 bucks a piece. Not terrible, but you don't want to break them left and right. And this feels like, uh, it feels like it's just a tad loose. Can I focus on that with the iPhone? Of course not. And then we'll see. So I don't know. That's uh, at least it works. When I was using a tap, you know, the incredibly tiny tap, uh, I was breaking them pretty often. And this went through and didn't break at all. I'm going to do a bunch more and see how it goes. See if I can make it go faster. That'll be exciting. So what am I doing at 10 p.m. on a Saturday night? I'm doing this. But. Now I'm getting out of here, so that's kind of a good feeling. All right, folks, thanks for watching. I mean, it was quick as hell, right? So no big deal for you. Appreciate you as always. Catch you next time.